Hello, I'm Sun Li. Today I would like to give a lecture about the Bilsi's work. This work is called Goldfish. Goldfish is the last piece of his Images Book 2. As we know, the Bilsi is the famous French composer and he is also the pioneer of impressionist music. Many people first know him through his work Moonlight. He is good at using small subjects to present nature scenes and expressing subjective feelings and intuitive impressions and also creating hazy and amazing atmosphere. And the goldfish shows the fish swimming freely in the water. The, the, this work is a piece for solo piano with complex structure, tonality and rhythm. And the score is marked with many musical terms. So if you want to perform this work very well, I think you should be aware of the meanings of the musical terms before you play in. Next, I would like to introduce and explain the three most important points in this piece, which are chill, arpeggio, and arpeggio. First, I would like to introduce the chill. Let's see the piece open with chill to show the flowing water. And you can see the musical terms on the first bar, like pianissimo and the feeling of rhythm. And each bar consists of three groups of eight 30 second notes forming the scale. And you can play it uh, smoothly, hastily, and rapidly. And many people don't know how to practice this part. So I would like to give a practice suggestion. First, for initial practice, you can divide them in groups and, and you can play them more clearly and slowly and make sure your hands neatly. And also you can add an accent to the first note uh, uh, in each group like this. with less volume and also you can uh, add una quarter to make them more smoothly like this and the second point is arpeggio there is a section of arpeggio in bark 7 to 9 first of all bark 7 is like goldfish uh, swimming fast and frostily, causing rapid changes in, in the current. Here, the left and right hand need to work together as if uh, they, are, they were playing with one hand. And again, you can practice in group like this. But be careful to pick up the left and right hands in time. Also, the volume should be unified. And pay attention, the line moves upward, uh, the volume should build up. And also, you can add sustain pedal to make them more smoothly, like this. And then, the D model mark is in bar A to 9 where the intensity diminishes to show that the water is much calmer. So here, the speed can be slowed down gradually, like this. And then you can link them together. which must be like to show the goldfish flexibility and the freedom of movement. So you can play it quickly like this. These three points are used intensively in, in this piece. So I think you should pay attention not only the way you play it, but also more importantly, the feeling, the emotion, 
and, uh, and the style. As this is an impressionist work, uh, the Busey's uh, original intention was to show the sensation of goldfish swimming and impacting uh, in the water through this work. So I think this piece fully demonstrates the remarkable thinking of this French composer and his long-standing innovations and, and breakthroughs in traditional music. So that's all for my lecture and thank you so much.